There are plenty of tropes in the world about children, and to be fair, some of them are real. Some kids are spoiled brats. Some are naturally gifted or prodigies. And some take things way too far because they think they're superior to others. Here's a hint, they're not. But one trope that really does apply to all children with good parents is that those parents will guard and protect their children from just about anything and go to bat for them at the drop of a hat. And while that's true for just about any common child, when you deal with celebrity children, it's a whole different level of protection. Here now are 20 most heavily guarded kids in the world. Number 20. Jojo Siwa Now, I will admit that this is a rather odd thing to start with, especially since Jojo Siwa is currently like 20 years old and adult and all that, but when you consider that she's someone who has been famous for most of her teen life, you can understand her guard detail has been going on for many years, and so she's used to having a rather protected lifestyle. That's because, as it may sound weird, child stars are almost always vulnerable especially when they have a great deal of influence or they may attract a certain kind of fan. Whether it was via Dance Moms, her time with Nickelodeon, her various businesses, or her singing career, Jojo Siwa has been on television for a very long time and her influence is quite well known. I mean, hell, in 2020, she was labeled one of Time Magazine's top 100 most influential people and that doesn't just happen without having some serious clout. Just to be clear, and note that I'm not trying to scare you, there are some really bad and creepy people who sometimes fall for a star like Jojo Siwa, and they've been known to be really, really creepy in how attached that they can get. Some celebrities have even died because of such types of fans. And there are those regular fans who are the same age as Jojo, who want nothing more than to see their favorite star every single day. So you can imagine why her and her family do things to keep her safe, like having a house that's not accessible to the public and having guards around when she does her shows and more. Some may even say that she's paranoid, but it's better to be paranoid than to have something bad happen to you. And in the world we live in right now, well, something bad can happen to you almost every single day. That's why many of the children on this list are on this list because there may just be someone coming after them for one reason or another. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Now it's time for the fancy topic. Take a look at this picture and please try to ignore the Dr. Evil looking baby in the middle and only focus on the dogs. Allegedly, this photo was meant to represent a young child who is so well protected that he doesn't need people to protect him because he has a set of four dogs at his disposal in order to ward off any attackers. While at first it may seem kind of ridiculous, it actually does track because during various points of history, when human protectors weren't enough for young princes and princesses, they would actually employ dogs to protect them. For example, you know of the dog species the Great Dane. These dogs were trained not only to hunt big beasts like wild boar, but also to protect young lords in their rooms. And they were known as chamber dogs because they would sit next to their leashes and then attack any intruder they didn't recognize like an assassin. Remember that one scene in season one of Game of Thrones with Bran Stark? Well, it's kind of the same principle. Outside of medieval times, people do get dogs solely because they need some extra protection around the household. So if someone thought that a set of four of these things would protect their child, well, they're probably going to have a very protected kid. Just look at the dogs. Would you want to mess with them? As always, you can comment down below using the hashtag fancy topic and let me know what you think in relation to what I just showed you on the screen. Number 19. Northwest. Now, things are going to get a little bit weird with this next one because I'm talking about the one and only Northwest. Young North is just over 10 years old, and she happens to be the daughter of Kanye West and Kim Kardashian. You should understand now why she is so well protected and on this list. 
but in case you can't, I will spell it out for you. First and foremost, even before a certain someone's fall from grace, North would have been the daughter of two very rich and famous people. Kanye was an established musician and businessman, and Kim K was a TV personality with a very large butt. As a result, if someone wanted to try and make a play for their money, they would go after the children and then seek a ransom. Kim K has already had something bad happen to her on the stolen property front, <laughs> and thus she wouldn't want it to happen to her kids. And don't forget, she was tied up in a room in Paris and robbed, and the experience has haunted her ever since. Another reason that they have high security for their kid is because of Kim and Kanye's status as celebrities and beyond. The paparazzi are always on their tail and looking for excuses to get new pictures of Kim's big butt. Finally, the biggest reason that Northwest needs protection is because of her father. Yes, the infamous Kanye West has taken quite a tumble in the public eye due to things like his anti-Semitic rants and his various verbal abuses against Kim K and really anyone that she's with, and he's even accused her of trying to keep the kids to herself while blocking him out of their birthday parties. While I won't go so far as to say he's capable of kidnapping, what I do know is that he's someone who will do anything at the drop of a hat if he feels that he's in the right. Number 18. Prince George of Wales If you've been thinking that I've been exaggerating in terms of children or teenagers that need protection, I'm going to stop that now by talking about Prince George of Wales. You know, the potential future King of England? I'm going to get right to the top kid-wise and discuss a literal prince in the world. As noted in the fancy topic, royal family members have had protection for generations due to people trying to come after them for one reason or another. I mean, after all, while kings and queens may be the rulers, that doesn't mean that everyone agrees with said rulers, and that wouldn't be opposed to trying to get one of them out of the picture if they believed it would help them or their country. And just so you know, the line of succession with the British royal family First, there's the current leader, King Charles. Were something to happen to him, his eldest son, Prince William, would take the throne. And should something happen to William, his son, Prince George of Wales, would be the next in line. So, right there, it highlights why his parents, William and Kate, are protecting him, because he may be the future ruler of the UK. The good news is that they've been doing a good job so far. Many details about Prince George are actually unknown because they're trying to keep his private life away from the public, and we can't blame them for wanting that. Another thing to remember is that while the royal family are in charge, they aren't really in charge at all, they're merely figureheads. But that's part of the problem. They're not even getting paid like figureheads. They're getting paid like they're actual royalty, and that has ticked off quite a bit of people over the years. Many want the royal family to be dissolved, and if they feel that they could get to the royal family through their children and their parents, well, they may well do so. So yeah, the kid needs protection, and it's fortunate for him that he basically has an entire nation's resources to ensure that it happens. Number 17. Ryan Kaji The next kid on this list is in the video, and not necessarily because of power or fame per se, but because of the wealth that he's accrued in his young life. To put it simply, the kid is rich, and it's almost hilarious how something so simple that he does has made him a wealthy man or child. You may not know the kid's name per se, but the name of his YouTube channel, Ryan's World, is one of the most prominent and profitable channels you'll find on the platform. When he was just three years old, his parents began making videos of him opening up toy boxes and later on reviewing them. Ryan's videos became a big hit, and he kept doing them as he got older. By the time he was 10, he was one of the highest grossing channels on all of YouTube. The kid just turned 12 and he's not even showing any signs of stopping. You see, outside of his YouTube channel, he has a business or two where he makes toys, video games, apps, and more. Talk about being a young business tycoon. He's also gotten tons of sponsorship deals, which includes television shows on Nickelodeon and Amazon Kids, and his net worth is said to be a hundred million dollars. It's only going up from there, everybody. So, does the kid need protection? Well, yes, because he's absolutely loaded and there are plenty of people who would love to come after his money. Number 16. True Thompson Now I'm going to go back to the realm of celebrity parents to talk about True Thompson, 
the daughter of Tristan, Thompson, and Khloe Kardashian. Yes, we have yet another Kardashian on this list whose butt is not as big, and it won't be the last. So why is True on this list? Thankfully, her parents aren't as controversial as Kim K and Kanye West, and her butt is not as big. But that doesn't exactly mean much when you really think about it. After all, all of the Kardashians and Jenners are absolutely bucket nuts, and when it comes to Chloe, her relationship with Tristan has been anything but stable. But the reason that we're placing True on this list is because her mother is never afraid to post about the child on her Instagram feed. While that's somewhat adorable in the overall sense, as it shows how much the mother loves her daughter, it also highlights how valuable she is based on where she is. For example, photos of her have been taken on jets, in exotic locations, wearing expensive clothes, and more. All of the Kardashians and Jenners outfit their children with the highest kid fashions and sometimes go all out on the expensive items to show off their wealth. It may seem like a great idea for them, but it's really not. It might make some people desperate enough to try and steal the items from the child, and thus she needs some security to help the wrong kinds of people to stay away from them. She has the money to afford the security, so she's definitely going to use it. Number 15. Prince Louis of Wales There will be many more royal children coming up on this list in the future, and the first of the rest of them is Prince Louis of Wales, who is the brother of the prince I've already talked about and the youngest child of William and Catherine. <laughs> Some of you may think that it would be odd to go after the other brother, given that Prince Louis is fourth in line of secession should anything happen to the king. But you always have to remember that when it comes to a family like this, every single one of them is valuable in the overall, regardless of where they are in the bloodline. So long as they're still connected to the family, they have power and wealth, and that makes them a target of those who may wish the royal line harm. Number 14. Stormy Webster Stormy Webster is the daughter of Kylie Jenner. Kylie Jenner went from the young and energetic kid of the Kardashian and Jenner household to just another one of the clan, although not with as big of a butt. And I don't mean that as a compliment. Not only did she overhaul her looks to match what her sisters and mother were like, she also adopted many of their business practices, including lying about the wealth of her company so that she could sell it for big bucks and then become the world's youngest self-made billionaire. Here's a hint, she's not self-made at all, and she's not even worth a billion. Irony can be quite rough, can't it? Anyways, Stormy Webster is indeed the apple of her mother's eye, but as I warned you with other parents in the family, She's known to shower her daughter with gifts. She even once gave Stormy a diamond that was worth $2 million for Christmas. Why would she do that? Because she's crazy. And she could. And that's why her daughter is at risk and needs to be protected. More than likely from her own mother. Number 13. Blue Ivy Carter I would really kind of pity anyone who tried to go after this next kid, the daughter of Jay-Z and Beyonce. Do I really have to spell out how stupid it would be for someone to try and go after this one? First off, if anything was to happen to her, Jay-Z could call in some old friends and have the entire country searching and people taken care of without needing to call the police, if you get my drift. Secondly, if something were to ever happen to Blue Ivy, entire legions of Beyonce fans would come up to help their favorite idol and would do everything they could to bring the kid back. So you'd basically be upsetting an entire nation if you were to even try and harm this child. But even with the stupidity factor being rather high in this one, we all know that there are some people who don't think properly when money is involved. And for the world's most famous baby, her value is off the charts, despite the fact that she's only 11 years old. Both of her parents are music icons, moguls, and are worth billions, so if something were to happen to them, she would get it all. And that's enough to place a target on her back, even if that target is not likely to be hit. Number 12. Princess Charlotte of Wales Princess Charlotte of Wales is the sister of George and Louise and is the only princess on that side of the family. Believe it or not, due to her age, 
She's actually third in line of secession, so she would be queen before Louis could be king should something happen to the ones above them. Given the monarchy's views on men and women at times, I mean, just ask Meghan Markle, you may be surprised that a princess could take the throne. But remember, Queen Elizabeth ruled for decades, and only after her death did King Charles be able to take the crown. So once again, it really comes down to the fact that all royal children are special in their own ways, and all of them are protected to ensure the bloodline doesn't get lost. Number 11. Isabella Barrett I'm going to shift gears for this one to look at a child star who became a teen businesswoman and talks about how life is still hard despite everything that she has. You may remember Isabella Barrett from the show Toddlers and Tiaras. Just thinking about that show makes me fear for the future of humanity, but I digress. Anyways, she's had multiple websites under her brand and she flies all over the place to get stuff done. To design, I get to, I'm actually wearing some of the clothes right now. Just for someone to do her makeup for her. Her net worth is in the millions and she's happy to flex on that. Does she need protection? Well, yes, mainly because some people might think that they could make money off of her capture. But then again, she moves around so much that she may just be hard to get. Number 10. Prince Charles of Luxembourg Prince Charles of Luxembourg is the child of the Grand Duke and Grand Duchess, who are certainly some unique people. But what would you expect from the royals? Simplicity? Never. Something to point out about this prince is that he's only three years old, as he was born in 2020. Boy, will his parents have something to tell him when he gets older about the year of his birth. Despite the fact that he is so young, he is the second in line of secession. However, given his age, there would be someone appointed as a regent or similar stature to hold the throne until he's old enough to take it himself whatever age that they consider that to be. Number 9. Vivian and Knox Jolie Pitt I'm not sure what last name to give these twins given that their parents are in the throes of a multi-year divorce settlement that's not really going anywhere, and it gets more vicious with each and every year that passes. But regardless, the first children of Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie were marked children from the days they were born because they were born to two of the most famous actors that have ever lived, both of them having been nominated for awards or having won them, and both having been part of famous movies and franchises, and they are still instantly recognizable. While you may not recognize the kids as much, especially since they're much more grown up than the others on this list, the fact that they're still tied to their parents, who are worth many millions of dollars, is enough to get them in this video. But I will want to warn you about something. Brad and Angelina are willing to get very vicious when it comes to gutting one another for the divorce. So what do you think they would do to someone who tried to hurt their children? Just saying. Number 8. Elon Musk's Kids And here I thought the most controversial person I'd have to talk about would be Kanye West. But oh no, I've got Elon Musk who over the course of only a few years went from a so-called mad genius to a dumb man-child. And when it comes to his own children, the story is just as complicated as the man himself. Now, for example, he doesn't have just one or two children, he actually has ten of them, and that's across a couple of women. That right there already raises the threat level because any of them could end up being a target. The other thing you have to consider is that Elon Musk is currently the richest man in the world. Even if he were to lose that title again, he would still be in the list of the top richest people in the world because he's worth hundreds of billions of dollars. So yeah, if you want his money, getting one of his children would be the way about going about it. But that's where the final twist comes in. You see, you'd have to get the right child because some of Elon's children hate him so much they actually changed their names so they wouldn't be associated with them anymore. Ouch. Number 7. Lil Tay I really don't want to talk about Lil Tay because this is an example of someone who needs to be protected from themselves. Lil Tay is a so-called social media star who got famous for doing stunts and acts on her profile, all of which was praised by her parents. But then, it apparently turned out her parents were actually abusive and trying to exploit their daughter for the cash that she earned. 
Lil Tay has accused her parents of all sorts of things over the years, and that's why the stunts that she's been part of have been so overdramatic. Case in point, in the last few months you may recall that there was a death hoax about Lil Tay, and that was apparently done by her father. She herself went back onto Instagram to blame him for various things, and many people couldn't help but roll their eyes at the entire situation. I don't blame them one little bit for that. Number 6. Surrey Cruz Now, I feel almost compelled to put Surrey Cruz on this list simply for the idea that I would fantasize about something happening to her and then Tom Cruise getting on a plane and doing a skydiving mission to try and get her back. After all, he does do all of his own stunts in Mission Impossible, so he would go as full tilt as possible to get his daughter back if he needed to, and you wouldn't even need to play the music as he did it. All jokes aside though, being the daughter of one of Hollywood's leading men is more than enough to get you on this list. Plus, when you remember that Tom had this child with his ex Katie Holmes, and the weirdness that went down with Scientology in that family and things are a bit strange, I'm going to be very kind putting it delicately like that. The point is, Surrey is not going to have the easiest life despite her famous parents, and so they're wise to do the best they can to protect her from harm so that past issues don't end up coming back to haunt them. Number 5. Monroe and Moroccan Cannon While not as famous as Tom Cruise in a lot of ways, the twins of Monroe and Moroccan Cannon have two very famous parents who have made their presence felt all over the place over the many years, that being Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey. Oh, did you forget that those two were once together? Well, they were, and they had quite a few children. While the couple are now divorced, they're very good with their children, and have been more than happy to co-parent together to ensure that the kids have a stable life, which is something that should be appreciated. So why would they need protection? Both of their parents are rich, Plus, there's probably people out there who may want to punish Mariah Carey for her Christmas songs that get played over and over and over and over again. Number 4. Mason, Penelope, and Rain Who are Mason, Penelope, and Rain? Well, they are the children of Kourtney Kardashian and her ex-husband Scott. I've been very adamant in my dislike about the Kardashian and Jenner clan, and Courtney is not immune from that. However, I will not punish the children for the dumb things that their parents do or will put them through. Only close the door several, you know. That is, not until they do the stupid stuff themselves. Which seems to be a given. I mean, after all, the family is absolutely nuts. For proof of this, even after Courtney and Scott had gotten divorced, the family actually tried to get them back together multiple times for a lot of dumb reasons. It never took, but the two do protect their children, and that's something that we should all be grateful for. Number 3. Prince Jacques and Princess Gabriella Welcome to Monaco, a place where you can do a lot of things, including gambling your wealth away. Or was that Monaco Casino? Either way, this is yet another country that has royalty, and Prince Jacques and Princess Gabriella are the ones in line for the throne should anything happen to the country's ruler, their father, Prince Albert. Now, as I've made clear, royal children are meant to be protected at all costs, and given the wealth that this particular royal family has, they are indeed well protected, and they'll go to the ends of the earth for their children should anything happen to them. Number 2. Prince Moulay Hassan from Monaco to Morocco, we talk about Prince Moulay Hassan, a 20-year-old future ruler who is definitely protected, especially now that he's older. And what do I mean by that? Well, despite being just 20 years old, he's also trying to follow his father's example by doing good in the world. Moulay Hassan was the youngest participant at the One Planet Summit in France in 2007, where he gained international acclaim, and he's done other official duties to help out his country. Whether he'll be a good ruler in the future, well, that's unknown, but the young man has proven he's willing to do certain things for his family and his country, and that means that he's off to a good start. Since he is the future ruler of Morocco, you can bet that they're going all out to protect the supposed future leader. Number 1. Everly Rose Finally, we have yet another young YouTube star via Everly Rose, who also happens to be rather big on social media. 
Despite being so young, she's well-versed in the art of business and has quite a few things going with both her family and her friends. This includes sharing certain accounts with her best friend. It's honestly astonishing how young that some of these millionaires are, as it also proves that sometimes you just really need to start young to get to the top, and there's obviously a bit of fortune and luck involved as well. So me and Savannah are actually about to go out on a date night. Compared to some other people I've discussed, which includes the royal family members, it may seem odd that I'm placing Everly Rose on this list. Everly is the daughter of media personalities Cole and Savannah LeBrant. She came to fame through her appearances in her parents' vlogs and social media content. The family is known for positive and family-oriented content and has a substantial following online. Part of Everly's charm and involvement in their digital presence is having contributed to their popularity. Everly's biggest claim to fame on YouTube is for dancing and being a toddler slash young person fashionista, whatever that means. And no doubt with her age and status, she'll be making videos and creating content for many years to come. That's all from the realm of kids who have really tight security around them, whether they like it or not. Are you shocked at the levels of security that these children have? And which ones do you think are the most protected? Perhaps you feel as though you know another kid or teenager that should have been on this list. As always, you can let me know all of your thoughts in the comments section down below. You should check out the other cool things that are showing up on the screen, and I will see you next time.